Hello folks, this is Tom with uh, Edward Yacht Sales and today we're looking at a 1987 Marine Trader Sun Deck Trawler. This is a single engine vessel and this vessel is in beautiful condition. This one has a single Lehman 135 engine in it uh, with 1800 hours on a rebuild. Runs like a top. She also has a 6.5 phase or gen set, two air conditioners. This is the perfect looper. The perfect one. I have a lot of clients that are looking for these single engine boats. They're getting rare as hen's teeth. Well, this here's one of them right here. Uh, also, the good thing about these uh, marine traders is that the keel extends below the prop. The prop is protected by a shoe that attaches to the rudder, so the prop is hidden. And uh, if you touch bottom, it, you can get in a lot of shallow places, which is very likely if you're doing the loop or are very handy wherever you go. A lot of times if uh, on a motor yacht such as that, if you touch bottom with a prop, throws a whole shaft out of alignment, very difficult to uh, and expensive to get repaired. And also, where will you be when something like that happens? These, these are rugged little boats. So we do have all chain road up here. Um, this is a boss anchor. You don't see those very often. Uh, the chain road is 200 feet long. Uh, the owner says this anchor works wonderful. We do have a Lumar anchor windlass. Again, the vessel is very pretty. I don't see many of this vintage uh, that look as nice as this one. Uh, the teak is all beautiful. Here's your side door right here. We'll go around to the sun deck. I see boats day in, day out. I'm kind of a, I kind of favor these trawlers. If I were going to choose a boat, it would be this one right now. Unfortunately, right now I'm not in market myself. So, come and get her. Now that's uh the owner hasn't decided whether he's going to take this uh, dinghy with him. This is a Portland Pudgy, and it's very stable, fairly heavy. It's on weaver davits right now, and it has an electric motor with the uh, that contains the battery right in the motor. So you, if you're going a ways, you just carry a spare battery with you. He says it gets along just fine. Very clean everywhere. You can definitely see pride of ownership with these owners. does have a full enclosure up here on the bridge. It's not up right now. You'll see that later in the video. Uh, it does not have an enclosure around the sun deck. Um, there are two solar panels up here. Or, excuse me, I think uh, four. Four solar panels. They're, they're 100 watts each. 
and let's go on down below and take a look at this okay I hope our lights right sometimes I have problems with this even here in sunny Florida let's go on down Your starboard settee there. Uh, there is a little, very minor pass damage to uh, around these windows. Usually, when people are looking at these uh, Asian boats, you can see right there. Uh, but it's sealed up tight now. So that was in the past. Now is now. I like those uh, blinds. They match the teak very well. I don't know if you can see that in this video. Should be able to. So. so Vizio, I believe it's a 29 inch Vizio here. Don't mark my word on that, but I think that's what it is. It's, it's ample enough size for easy viewing here in the salon little flip down chair here you'll see that in my photos here's your downstairs station vessel is equipped with autopilot chart plotter everything you need need for safe navigation little breakfast bar here inverters all over this boat uh, it has a uh, 2000 watt Xantrex down below Here's your uh, electrical panel, uh, 12 volt and 110. And we'll go down the galley now. Let's take a shot up here of it. The stove is propane. Uh, the propane tank is mounted in a locker up on the fly bridge. There will be pictures of that in my video as well. Or on the, uh, there will be still photos of that in my regular advertising. Uh, while I'm talking about that now, uh, I am Tom. We are with uh, Edwards Yacht Sales. Uh, we advertise on close to 60 websites. Oh, she's so neat. Look at this. Anyway, we advertise, uh, straighten that up later, it's a four burner stove with an oven. We advertise on about 60 websites. Uh, you'll see us on yachtworld.com, our own site, Edwards Yacht Sales, Boat Trader, and a whole host of, uh, of others. Um, just look this one up. Um, It'll take me about a week to build marketing. This uh, video may hit YouTube before the marketing does. I will cross-link them. Uh, but there will be well over 100 still photos of this vessel. And every scrap of information that I can get on the vessel while I'm aboard, I get it. Um, usually the first thing people see is the advertisement. And those are things you need to know when you're in the market for a boat. I'm not going to go down in the engine room uh, with a video today, but I have many, many photos of the engine room. This is your forward state room. It doesn't have the typical V berth, but has a large, double, very large, and then a little place uh, where you can take your shoes on and off. It's a chain locker up there. It's your ship's plaque. And an escape hatch uh, for ventilation. You step back, come back to the right here. Uh, here is your forward head. It's in here. Everything is clean, clean, clean. Very, very nice.
Also, here's something unique for the guys. Let me open this up. In this head, look here. Okay. It's behind the panel, all your wiring. It's right there, easy to get to. Okay, let's go back to the master. The overhead is clean, it's in good shape. And I think I got these chairs already, probably did. And uh, now we're going into the master stateroom. Of course, this is a full beam master, so it takes up the entire width of the boat, gives you a little bit more room. I think it's very well done. Uh, it's very warm and inviting on this boat. There isn't a foul odor or strange odor anywhere. No diesel, uh, no holding tank odors, uh, no moldy or anything like that. This boat is just clean and very pretty. This is really nice for the ladies, a vanity here with a mirror. You have some drawers there for your things. And a light above it. Now my wife and Susan did own a trawl, uh, my wife, Susan and I, I should say, did own a trawler, single engine trawler, very similar to this one for a very long time and uh, that's one of the best things I've ever done. This is the aft head. It does have a shower and a uh, European style that you can use in your hand if you wish. All the toilets are manual. Now that may be a little odd to some, but these things are much more dependable than an electric toilet which can break. You don't want that when you're offshore. Uh, this is a queen size berth. Now with a single 135 horsepower layman in this vessel, uh, cruise speed you might uh, be burning a tad over two gallons an hour. Exactly what it is, I don't know. It depends on weather conditions, uh, this, that, and the other thing, how fast you're going. But it does carry uh, 350 gallons of diesel, which is very good range for a boat like this. If you're going to do the loop, this would be a very good choice, or this would be a very good choice just to call it yours. I'd be proud to own this boat. It's very nice. Well, anyway, again, my name is Tom. I'm with Edward Yacht Sales. We're just people around here. Uh, do not be afraid to give me a call and uh, talk to me about this boat. You know where to find the advertising on it. My number's on all those things. My direct number. You can call me. I'm glad, I'd be glad to talk to you about this vessel. Just give me a shout. And, uh, thank you for coming today. Bye-bye now.